Airbus spaceplane may be the future of space tourism. Airbus, Europe's biggest aerospace manufacturer, is now developing the spaceplane, a vehicle designed to bring cargo or paying passengers into suborbital space. The spaceplane has been in the works since 2006, when Astrium, then a subsidiary of EADS, European Aeronautic Defense and Space Company, began developing the vehicle. Development slowed down in 2011, but the company has continued to work on the project in spite of the global economic crisis. We keep the investment going, said Astrium CEO Francois Auch in a BBC report. We continue to mature the concept, maintaining the minimum team, in order that when we find the relevant partnership we are ready and have progressed sufficiently. According to Airbus, the target is to produce five aircraft per year and eventually maintain a fleet of 30-plus aircraft within the next 10 years. Flights will cost about $225,000 per passenger. The Beluga XL is a vital component of Airbus's global production network, ensuring the timely and efficient delivery of large aircraft components between manufacturing facilities. Its massive cargo hold allows it to transport entire wings, fuselages, and other critical parts, eliminating the need for overland transportation or multiple smaller shipments. This streamlined transportation process reduces the risk of damage during transit and significantly improves the overall efficiency of Airbus's production operations. By minimizing the time it takes for components to reach assembly lines, the Beluga XL helps to accelerate the production of new aircraft and meet customer delivery schedules. Additionally, the Beluga XL's ability to transport large components directly to assembly plants reduces the need for extensive on-site storage facilities, further streamlining the production process. This efficiency gain is particularly important for Airbus's A350 program, which requires the transportation of large, pre-assembled sections of the aircraft. The ASAP Hybrid Helicopter is a concept aircraft that combines the vertical takeoff and landing capabilities of a helicopter with the efficiency and range of an airplane. It is designed to be a more efficient and sustainable alternative to traditional helicopters with the potential to revolutionize air travel. The ASAP Hybrid Helicopter is powered by a hybrid propulsion system that combines a traditional piston engine with an electric motor. This system allows the aircraft to fly in both helicopter and airplane modes, making it more versatile than traditional helicopters. In helicopter mode, the ASAP hybrid helicopter can take off and land vertically, making it suitable for a wide range of applications, including urban air mobility and search and rescue missions. In airplane mode, the ASAP hybrid helicopter can fly for long distances at high speeds, making it ideal for transporting passengers and cargo over long distances. Hybrid Airship Technology Sir Richard Branson, hybrid airship technology represents an important and exciting aviation milestone. Hybrid airships are a completely new type of high-tech. Heavy lift aircraft that offers a dramatically less expensive and an environmentally friendly alternative to traditional modes of cargo and passenger transportation. With the ability to take off and land nearly vertically, hybrid airships can operate in the most remote and inaccessible locations without any of the infrastructure needed to support conventional air transportation. At first glance, because of their immensity and shape, hybrid airships may bear some resemblance to the airships of old, but that is about as far as any real comparison can be made economically. Environmentally and technologically, the hybrid airships are highly advanced aircraft. The Xping X2 is a stylish and tech-packed electric SUV from China. With its sleek design, powerful electric motor, and impressive range, it's a great option for drivers who want a modern and eco-friendly ride. Plus, it's packed with features like autonomous driving and a smart voice assistant. The Xping X2 is a mid-size SUV that offers a comfortable and spacious interior. The seats are comfortable and supportive, and there's plenty of legroom and headroom for both passengers and cargo. 
The interior is also well equipped with a variety of features, including a large touchscreen infotainment system, a voice assistant, and a panoramic sunroof. Overall, the Xping X2 is a great electric SUV that offers a combination of style, performance, technology, and safety. It's a good option for drivers who are looking for a modern and environmentally friendly car. The nuclear-powered Sky Hotel is a futuristic concept that envisions a massive flying hotel powered by nuclear energy, capable of staying airborne for extended periods. This airborne hotel would use a nuclear reactor to generate virtually unlimited power, allowing it to carry thousands of passengers while offering luxury amenities like restaurants, swimming pools, and entertainment spaces, all while flying high in the sky. Designed to remain in the air for months at a time, this concept would only require passengers and supplies to be flown in via smaller aircraft. Combining cutting-edge engineering with sustainable energy, the nuclear-powered Sky Hotel could revolutionize both travel and hospitality, offering a once-in-a-lifetime experience of luxury in the skies. While still in the conceptual phase, it represents a bold vision of the future of travel. A blimp cargo vehicle, also known as a cargo airship, is a lighter-than-air aircraft designed to transport heavy loads over long distances. Unlike traditional airplanes, blimps use helium or hydrogen for lift, allowing them to hover and move efficiently with less fuel consumption. This makes them ideal for carrying large, bulky cargo to remote or hard-to-reach areas without the need for runways. These airships can be used for everything from humanitarian aid deliveries and disaster zones to transporting industrial equipment and rugged terrain. While still under development in many areas, cargo blimps offer a promising, eco-friendly alternative for future logistics and transportation solutions. Triton Submarines announced it's building the Abyssal Explorer to return to the Titanic wreckage. The company says the vehicle will be able to withstand depths of 4,000 meters. Triton Submarines is known as an industry leader, having dived to depths that make a Titanic expedition look simple. Its vehicles have been to the depths of Mariana Trench, the deepest point on Earth at more than 10,900 meters below sea level. Titanic, by comparison, sits at 3,800 meters. Leahy spoke with CBC Radio Canada in the wake of the Titan disaster. He talked about how he met the Ocean Gate crew while on vacation in the Bahamas and was unimpressed by their work. He said he pointed out several flaws with Titan and assumed the company would never get it to the point of making a deep sea dive. Ether Experience, a luxury cruise airship concept by Mac Byers based on an airship platform. The Ether Cruise experience by UK-based designer Mac Byers allows guests to experience a wider range of destinations in a shorter time, all the while enjoying some of the greatest views imaginable. The exterior of the vehicle is conceived to look unlike any airship ever produced, removing notions of danger, like the Hindenburg disaster in 1937. The concept visually communicates a new generation airship that is not only safe but clean, influenced by the Thunderbird 2, Star Wars, and the NASA Space Shuttle. Drawing reference from suspension bridge cables, the lobby integrates structural cords for details like stairways and tables. The interior space has been designed to be as open as possible, encouraging social interaction and providing a communal gathering place for users to meet. Airbus A330neo The Airbus saves space, weight, and enables customization in new A330neo cabin interior. Airbus A330neo cabin interior debuts at Aircraft Interiors Expo 24. Airbus continues to innovate in the aerospace sector by unveiling its new airspace cabin interior features for the A330neo at the Aircraft Interiors Expo AIX, in Hamburg. This next-generation cabin design promises to elevate the passenger experience and offers airlines enhanced customization options. Key features include a customizable Hero Light, 
electrodimmable windows, and new linings for sidewall panels and ceilings that contribute to both passenger comfort and significant weight savings. These updates not only enhance the visual appeal and functionality of the cabin, but also align with Airbus's ongoing efforts to innovate and reduce environmental impact with lightweight solutions. The Hyperloop is an innovative transportation system designed to move passengers and cargo at incredible speeds through low-pressure tubes, drastically reducing travel times. First proposed by Elon Musk, the Hyperloop uses magnetic levitation, or maglev technology, to lift pods off the tracks, minimizing friction and allowing them to travel at speeds of up to 760 miles per hour. Inside these nearly airless tubes, resistance is so low that the pods can glide efficiently, making the Hyperloop faster and more energy efficient than airplanes or trains. This futuristic concept could connect major cities in a fraction of the time it currently takes, revolutionizing long-distance travel with a greener and more cost-effective solution. Though still in the development phase, the Hyperloop has the potential to reshape the way we move, offering a glimpse into the future of transportation. Xping Aerot's land aircraft carrier flying car debuts, showcasing its first flight and future application scenarios. September 3, 2024, Guangzhou Xping Aerot hosted a preview event showcasing its modular flying car, the land aircraft carrier, marking the first public appearance of the physical vehicle in Guangzhou. The event featured a live demonstration of the air module's flight, offering a glimpse into the future of flying cars. Xping Aerot's founder, Zhao Deli, provided a detailed overview of the company's journey, its mission and vision, the three-step product development strategy, highlights of the land aircraft carrier, and key commercialization plans for this year. The land aircraft carrier will make its first public manned flight at the China Air Show in Zhuhai, one of the world's four major aviation events, this November. Additionally, it will appear at the Guangzhou International Auto Show in November, with pre-sales expected to start by the end of the year. The Orb Nomad, the next airplane is an orb, is a futuristic concept that reimagines air travel with a unique, spherical design. Unlike traditional airplanes, the Orb Nomad features a compact, orb-like structure that allows for vertical takeoff and landing VTOL, making it perfect for urban air mobility. Powered by electric propulsion, this aircraft is designed to offer eco-friendly, efficient air travel with minimal noise and zero emissions. The spherical shape not only enhances aerodynamic efficiency but also provides stability during flight, allowing for smoother rides and increased safety. As the next step in personal and urban air transportation, the Orb Nomad pushes the boundaries of how we think about flying, offering a glimpse into a future where air travel is more accessible, sustainable, and efficient. Archer Aviation Midnight Archer Aviation is developing multiple models of all-electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL, aircraft focused on improving mobility in cities, called Advanced Air Mobility AAM. The company announced its launch on May 21, 2020. With a facility adjacent to the Palo Alto Airport in the San Francisco Bay Area, USA, Archer is dedicated to reshaping urban air mobility, focusing on saving time for users in urban areas. The company is led by co-founders Brett Adcock and Adam Goldstein. Serial entrepreneurs sold the marketplace startup Vettery to the Adeco Group for over $100 million USD. According to the Crunchbase website, the company has raised a total of $1.1 billion USD as of January 4th, 2023. Airbus Pop-Up Ital Design and Airbus unveil Pop-Up, a trailblazing modular ground and air passenger concept vehicle system. During the 87th Geneva International Motor Show, Ital Design and Airbus World premiered Pop-Up, the first modular, fully electric, zero-emission concept vehicle system designed to relieve traffic congestion in crowded megacities. 
Pop-Up envisages a modular system for multimodal transportation that makes full use of both ground and airspace. The feasible concept is the result of Ital Design and Airbus joint reflection on how to address the mobility challenges of megacities achievable for a majority, which has become one of the most pressing issues for commuters in megacities worldwide. With traffic congestion projected to hugely increase by 2030, the companies decided to combine their engineering expertise to tackle how to best achieve a sustainable, modular, and multimodal urban mobility system, giving rise to the pop-up concept. Solar cargo gliders are a promising concept for sustainable aviation. These aircraft use solar energy to power their flight, making them a much more environmentally friendly option than traditional aircraft that rely on fossil fuels. Several companies and organizations are actively developing solar cargo gliders. One example is Airbus, which has partnered with the German Aerospace Center, DLR, to develop the Solar Impulse Glider. The Solar Impulse is a large, high-altitude aircraft that is powered entirely by solar energy. It has a wingspan of 120 meters and can fly for up to 24 hours on a single charge. Overall, solar cargo gliders represent an exciting development in the field of sustainable aviation. They have the potential to make a significant impact on the environment and the economy.